Hey everybody, I'm back to bring you guys a brand new episode installment of X-Men Legends and it's going to be brought to you guys by GameAnyone.com Okay, so we got an X-Men down, so we're going to need to get a replacement real fast. Fortunately, we have so many X-Men to choose from over here in the change team menu. Okay, so I was liking the flow of the free women one man, so I'm going to go ahead and keep with that flow and I'm going to get Jean Grey out. Jean Grey. Because she's the only woman available right now for the moment. Alright, might as well go ahead and deal with Rogue real fast, because she's got one point to spare. And as much as I enjoy balancing my character, because I'm all about balance, I really want to make Rogue into more of a body tank type person. And, you know, how it is in RPGs and World of Warcraft and such. I've said this before, but just want to reinforce it. So, I'll go ahead and I'll give her one for toughness, and I already gave one for body. Perfect. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. Let's break legs, people. Literally, I want to break some legs. Probably on the brutes. And I guess the claws, because they're annoying as hell as well. Ooh, grab this here, because I can sell it to Forge. Alright, so it looks like I'm going to have to destroy some mainline reservers real fast. Or, it, no, not the mainline reserver. i got to go ahead and destroy the pumps. There we go. That way I can go into the next area. Okay, let me go ahead and give a health pack to Storm real fast. Because she's really low on it. Oh my god, look at all these Morlock Claws around here. Oh god, I gotta get Rogue here on this. And low, Nightcrawler leveled up too. Even better. It's like it's candy store for all my X-Men here. With the candy being, of course, the Morlocks. And the X-Men being little boys and girls. So yeah, Rogue, you go ahead and deal with the claws, and Storm can go ahead and deal with the brutes that are around. There's one brute around, but it looks like he was taken down clearly because of your awesome lightning. Ooh, what's through this door? Going through. Uh oh, spikes. You know what? I better go around. Uh, could you get out of the way, Storm? Thank you, Storm. Get over here, Nightcrawler. I want to look around here first. I might miss something. Don't you just hate it when the AI just start attacking those enemies when you don't want it to happen? Seriously, that crap gets annoying as hell. There we go. I've just realized that Morlock Claws have the ability to throw projectiles. And I also realized that this thing right here is basically for Focus 201. I've got to go back into that danger room. I've yet to do those 201 classes. Or the next level. I can already tell they're going to be hard to deal with, but at least they'll level up my X-Men. So that's good to know. You're done for, pretty. Uh, says who? Ah, uh, screw it. I'll go through here. Why not? Just jump over the spikes. I mean, I'm not going to ignore those spikes, clearly, because they're pretty dangerous. Not only in this game, but in other video games as well. Whoa, okay. So clearly, Rogue's out of your lead. Or, you're out of Rogue. Forget it. You know what I mean, people. Let me switch to Storm real fast. Okay, yeah, that's much better. What was I thinking getting Rogue to go up against a Brute? God. Should have gone up against the Claws. I had a plan here. I wasn't sticking with that plan. Ooh, a couch. Let's destroy it. Okay, nothing in there. Alright. Just want that stuff to be in there, people. Uh-oh, looks like we're dealing with some Brutes surrounding the hell out of us. Uh, let me do this here. So you're on so to that way it confuses the crap out of them. There we go. My god, look at all these bodies. Makes me think of the music video, Let the Bodies Hit the Floor by Drowning Pool. I, got, I swear, that music had got so overused when you two first started around, it's not even funny. Yeah, let's go ahead and sh Sonic shout all you guys here. Look at all these bodies hitting the floor. Jeez. Okay. I believe that's all of you guys in this area. So let's move on now. Oh, it looks like you guys had a pretty cool, comfortable place here, huh? I mean, it's underground and such. And Oh my god, did someone pee on there? Ugh, God help the person who had to sleep on that. Yeah, surprise, surprise indeed, a-hole. 
That one didn't even last a chance here. Anything in here I should know about? Yeah. Let me just go ahead and be a total dick and just destroy everyone's shit in here. For fucking with us. I mean, yeah, we came down here first, but... You didn't have to attack us. We're just looking for our X-Men here. An X-Men who your leader has a past with. Good. Finally that Bruce's done with. I gotta start using Jean Grey more. She's very useful in this game. Just like all the other X-Men. Okay, so there goes one of the water flows. Let's go ahead and take this down. And now my AI combatants are now helping me. Perfect. Okay, now to deal with the other pump, which is in the eastern trunk line. Okay, Storm, can we please get you over here? Thank you very much. There we go. Thank you. And Jean Grey leveled up. Oh, nice. As soon as you have the ability to blow people's minds. Okay, go ahead. Deal with that. See around here. God, you just love destroying shit. Take care of this one claw here. Finally. Okay, let's go ahead and head back now. Oh god, there were more of these guys here. When I choose to do when I choose to go back, I was hoping that there'd be no more enemies to fight. Going through this door here, which I believe was the other way that didn't involve the spikes. And we should be back over to there, the other side now. Perfect. Let's go back into the mainline reserver. Assistance would be greatly appreciated. Well, shit, Storm, you can use a health pack, thank you very much. Even though I'm controlling you and you can't do it when I'm controlling you. All right, let's go back in this east line truck. Or this east truck line. Okay. All right, so to make sure that no one be stupid and die because of crap like this again, I'm going to switch to Jean Grey real fast. Okay. And do this. There. So no one has to die again. Speaking of which, did I get this thing that was over here? Yes, surprise, I did. Surprise. It was the comic book, I believe, that focused on Storm. So Storm's ability should permanently increase now. I'm really enjoying getting these comic books. They're very helpful to me. Those sketchbooks, eh, I really don't care much about the concept art. Or at least getting the concept art. Okay, so here's some claws coming around. Here goes the brutes. God, is this all I'm going to be dealing with in this level? If so that's the case, then strike one over to the developers of this game for not putting in more Morlocks. Or different types of Morlocks. Okay, you're gone. You're out of here. Moving on over up to the other area. Which now I'm going to be heading over to the next pump. Which should be nearby, hopefully. Oh, so oh look at all these Morlock Claws. It's like I'm playing Left 4 Dead 2 online or something. You ain't walking away from this. They're not even that much challenging, honestly. God, my God, these X-Men are just having a field day with these guys. Okay, you're still kicking. Screw it, I'm not even going to deal with you right now. I'm just going to go over here and take care of all these other guys. Then I'll head over to the pump. Ooh, someone dropped something. A focus enhancer. Okay, then. Nice. Opening the door, switching the storm, because I'm tired of this brute now. Okay, you're gone. Oh, crap. Another one. Grab the health packs. Really love getting these health packs. Okay, game, please. Don't you go. Thank you. Okay, looks like I'm going in the right track. 
place can become a maze sometimes, especially without the map with you. Goody, Storm leveled up. Perfect. I'll go ahead and level up my X-Men when I get to another extraction point. Okay, perfect. Alright, it's basically a dead end, but I think I can break open a wall here. Perfect. Now that that's done, let's go ahead and do this. No. No. Are you... S oh, okay. Never mind. I was going to go ahead and wind about that. Alright, both the pumps are shut down now. Let's get up out this bitch. I'm flying. Screw this. A lot more easier flying. Grab that. Oh, don't need the energy pack. Okay, then. God, it can get awkward when you don't talk much, huh? Wait, am I in a dead end again? No, no, wait, I think I'm going the right way. This door is already open. Okay, yeah, going the right way indeed. All right, now I should be able to go into the other area now. Get one more step closer into getting Gambit. We should be really thankful that we decided to come rescue him. Especially in considering the past he's had. All right, can we finally go downstairs now, please? Okay, good. Now that this is done, we should go into the Morlock's home. Morlock Haven, to be more precise. Alright, so this is basically their own little headquarters. And objects are updated. Let's go ahead and ask around for Gambit. Get away from me, sun stunts. We don't want you tight down here. We're looking for a human named Gambit. Have you seen him? I said get away from me. Jeez, talk about hospitality. Hi, can I help you? Have you seen a man named Gambit? Last we heard, he was here in the sewers. No, but you might ask Keeler. He knows everything that goes on down here. Everything? Okay, then. Looks like some of these Morlocks are basically assholes. While some are nice. That's how most people should be nowadays. Especially to guests. Can't go through here then, screw it. Oh, here's another Morlock. Get away from me, sun sucks, blah blah blah, all that crap, okay then. Basically all of these Morlocks are just gonna say the same thing over and over again. Alright, let's go up here to the center. Hello? Talk to Morlock Healer. Greetings. Unless I'm mistaken, you are the X-Men. Yes! We are. How did you know? I don't know, Storm. Maybe because of the costumes you guys are wearing? Ah, every Morlock has heard of you. I am the healer. I am the spiritual leader of the Morlocks. I am also a skilled herbalist. What is a herbalist? <laughs> I care for the sick of our tribe by creating medicines from various plants. Given the proper ingredients, I would be happy to make healing potions for you. Oh, okay then. Could you make uh, other things? Things that were... You know, I'm going to stop right there because I don't even want to get in trouble with that <laughs> next time I was going to say. Have you seen a mean in Gambit down here? Marrow has forbidden any discussion on the subject. Sounds like there's more going on than anyone's willing to tell us. I cannot answer that. But I would warn you to be wary should you search our tunnels for the Cajun thief. I am the. Uh, wait, wait, no, 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 crap. <laughs> Didn't mean that. We have been attacked several times. Why are the Morlocks so agitated? These are confusing times for my people. What do you mean? Marrow is losing sight of what her people want. She's leading them down a violent path. I, on the other hand, trying to steer us towards peace. Never have Marrow and I been so divided on an issue. Good to show me what you have for sale. Alright, so now I can basically visit Healer's Den whenever I'm going to an extraction point to where I could go ahead and get some health packs and energy packs too. 
So with that being said, got enough energy packs as it is, and health packs, I can buy me a few more. Though they cost about 325 text picks. Oh, there's also combined powers 101 and 102. I might as well go ahead and grab this, since it looks like I ignored it these earlier in the game. Let me see if I can sell you some things. Uh, here, how about I sell you this basic electron deflector? So I'll just grab myself this combined powers. There we go, 102. Yeah, I'm a bit of a collector of sorts if you don't mind. Alright, now that that's done... Me to sm oh, oh, wait, right, I can't smash those boxes because, of course, the game won't allow me to do that. Let's talk to Mero. Upworlders, you have no business in the realm of the Morlocks. Be gone from here. Are you the leader of the Morlocks? Yes, I am Mero. We have no need for the likes of you down here in our dark world. Jeez, I'm sensing a lot of prejudice over here. We're searching for a mutant named Gambit. Gambit. Yes, I've met him, but he's not been seen in our tunnels for a very long time. Are you sure? A short time ago, we received a radio transmission saying he was in your tunnels. The radio transmission was obviously wrong. Your friend is not down here. Hmm, I see then. You anger me because you live in a world of light and beauty while we outcasts are forced to live in darkness. Uh, you can join us up there in the sun. You're more than welcome to leave the sewers and join us in the sun. Liar! You speak sweet phrases, but you don't mean them. Mark my words. Soon we Morlocks will be treated as equals to those who walk in sunlight. Okay, then we're going to go continue search our friend. It's useless. You won't find him here. Yeah, I doubt that. I'm pretty sure you're responsible for it, Meryl. Considering the past you have with Gambit, yeah, for those that don't know, Gambit made a deal with the Sinister Minister in order to... Well, basically, his powers were going really out of control and such. So, Sinister Minister went inside Gambit and got a piece of his brain out that allowed him to keep his powers in check and such. So, now, Gambit basically had to keep it in the bargain. And he, along with other group of mutants, including Cybertooth, Basically went on and killed a whole bunch of Morlocks in a massacre. He didn't know about this and he regretted this whole thing, so he tried to save one mutant and that mutant's name was Morlock. Sad story too, to be honest with you. Alright, let me go ahead and level up my X-Men real fast. Let's go to characters. Okay, so it looks like three out of my four X-Men leveled up. Let's go ahead and focus on Jean Grey real here. Alright, let's go ahead and get your strike up to 10. No, in fact that, we're going to go ahead and get your body up to 9. There we go. And for your abilities, let's go ahead and give you... Uh, I guess I can give you telekinesis. And of course, i got a lot more items that I can equip you with. So let me go ahead and give you... Hmm, I'll go ahead and I'll give you... A DNA regenerator so that we can get your energy back up since you use a lot of mutant attacks all right for storm you I got a lot for you I'll go ahead and give you a focus enhancer to increase your energy points I'll also go ahead and I'll get your body up to one and for your abilities here as much as I would love to increase your lightning strike and match it out so I can have a chance to upgrade to chain lightning I'll go ahead and I'll give one over to Warwind for balance reasons. That's pretty much going to be it for you. And last but not least, Nightcrawler. You, I'm going to go ahead and I'll give you one for Shrike. And then I'm going to go and give you a good old fashioned upgrade of Sucker Punch. Which I can't do because clearly you're at level 11 where I need to be at level 14. So I'll just give you Teleport Fury. Okay, that should do it. Alright, moving on now. You know, I've, all I've been dealing basically is Morlock Brutes and Morlock Claws. I was hoping for another type of Morlock people to deal with. Thank you very much. You're done for, oh wait, looks like there is. Hold up, there's one new over here. A lady. I believe that is a... Oh, a Morlock Goth. And a Morlock Goth's Metal Resistant. Oh, that's just great. For those that don't know, Morlock Goths are basically the healers. Let's go with that. 
That's clearly you can see from the way that Morlock has provided back the brute. Okay, so what's over here? Let me check over the bridge. I think there might be some. All oh, right, an extraction point. Okay, cool. All right, so let me go ahead and hit the extraction point. Let me go ahead and visit Forge real fast because I want to sell some things. I'll sell a basic electron defector. And I'll also go ahead and I'll sell. I want to go ahead and sell. No, wait. Yeah, Ring of Polaris. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and not sell that because I need that actually. You know what? Scratch that. I'll just sell that one item I did. Sold. I was hoping to get enough tip picks to bring Jubilee back, but that's not going to be the case this time. All right, moving on over here. So we got a new type of Morlocks to deal with. That's good enough. At least it shows that they got some variety here. The developers did. We got some more, but we still got the mostly brutes and cloth to deal with. You're done for, God, are you going to go down? Thank you. Okay, I didn't mean to grab you. Do you want it to open the door, though? Oh, grab the health pack. All right, now let's go through here now to the door. Okay, let me deal with the goths first. The goths should be your always main target. They should always come first because, well, they're the healers, they're the white mages. You all know this. Okay, well, nothing over here. And again, nothing over here but other beds. And the same textures that have been used previously before. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, damn it, they took out Storm. And that's just great. Storm was basically the main reason why I was able to own these brutes. Okay, but no too big. I got Jean Grey here to help me out here in this situation. Okay, Nightcrawler a little bit right. up again. Thank it's you. good to hear. Alright, so let me go ahead and move on now. I'm sure there's going to be another extraction point. The second thought, let me go back to the extraction point. Uh, I noticed that it's been around 22 minutes, so once I get back to the extraction point, I'll end the episode here. Ah, oh, jeez. So I made a lot of progress in this game, fortunately. Or in this episode, at least. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and I'll end this episode right now. Thanks for watching, everyone, and be safe.